How should we spend the last 10 nights of Ramadan? Well, the Prophet والسلام, had a major thing to do during the last 10 nights of Ramadan, and that is to pray all night long. So whenever the 10 nights were due, the Prophet والسلام, would tighten his apron or waist wrapper, and some say that this is a metaphor for not having intimacy with the wives. And some say that this is a metaphor for doing a lot of effort and striving and doing what you want to do to the most utmost uh, uh, level. So he used to do that. He used to wake up his women, his wives, and he used to revive his night, meaning that he would make the night alive with prayers, reciting the Quran, and long, long uh, rak'ahs. So this is the vast majority of what a person has to do in the last 10 nights of Ramadan. Most of us won't be able to do even half of that. So you do whatever you can to the best of your ability. Engage in making dua. Because Mother Aisha came to the Prophet والسلام, and said, Oh Prophet of Allah, teach me something to say if I were to notice Laylatul Qadr. So the Prophet said to her, say, Allahumma inna ka'afuun tuhibbul afwa fa'afu anni. O oh Allah, you are forgiven and you love to pardon, so pardon me. So if you do this a bit, this a bit, recite the Quran a little bit, do dhikr a little bit, so that the whole night is engaged in good deeds, that would be an excellent thing for you to do.